Many bloggers will tell you that email marketing is a waste of time, but I'm here to tell you they are wrong. Welcome to the Productive Blogging YouTube channel. My name is Eb Gagano and today I'm talking about eight reasons why every blogger needs an email list. Number one, email marketing keeps your readers coming back. Imagine someone arrives on your blog and they absolutely love everything about your blog and they want to hear more from you. How can they do that? Well, they could follow you on social media, but the way the algorithms work these days, there's a good chance they'll actually never see your stuff again. Or they could sign up for your email list and every single week they would get an email from you land into their inbox. You spend so much time and effort getting people to come to your blog in the first place. So why not also spend a little bit of time getting those people that have already been on your blog once to keep coming back again and again and again. Number two, email marketing turns casual blog readers into raving super fans. When someone arrives on your blog, they don't know who you are and the chances are they'll just get the information they came for, leave and never come back. But what if you could take that casual reader and turn them into a raving super fan? With email marketing, you can do that. If you can get them onto your list, you can start talking to them through your email newsletter week in, week out, and they can come to love you and love you so much that they, they rave about you to all their family and friends. They follow you everywhere and they buy all of your stuff. Number three, you own your list. You could be getting great traffic from Facebook or Pinterest, but did you know you don't own any of your followers there? You could wake up one day to discover there's been an almighty algorithm change and your traffic has halved overnight. You could wake up one day to discover that Pinterest or Facebook have just deleted your account because they thought that you had committed some kind of uh, some kind of infraction or you'd you'd violated their terms and and they just delete your account just like that gone or your favorite social media channel could just fizzle out and disappear anyone remember friends reunited yeah it could go exactly the same way but with email marketing you own your list it's yours, nobody can delete it or take it from you. Number four, there is so much less competition with email marketing. Imagine you have a follower who follows you on social media. When they go onto social media each time, they are bombarded by hundreds and thousands of messages from different people that they followed. And often those people are doing social media way better than you are. But then think about email marketing. Unless your subscriber subscribes to every little bit of junk mail out there, you're gonna have a lot less competition for their attention. In fact, you could be the most interesting thing in their inbox. Think about what most people get into their inbox. It's things like bank statements and reminder letters from the dentist, boring stuff, so that when your exciting email newsletter pops into their inbox, they're going to click on yours as the first thing. Number five, email marketing is passive. With social media, your follower has to go on that social media platform. With Google, they have to do a Google search. But with email marketing, your email just lands into their inbox every week. And most people check their emails at least once a day. And even if they don't, your email is going to stay there in their inbox until they do check uh, their emails and then they'll see it there. Totally the opposite of what happens on social media. If one of your followers doesn't check in to social media for a few days, they don't see any of your messages from those few days. Number six, the engagement is way better. Did you know average engagement on social media is about 0.58%? That means Every message that you put out in social media gets only about six, so it gets engagement from only about six in every 1,000 followers. Compare that to the stats on email marketing. Every email you send gets seen by about 85% 
of the people on your list. It gets opened by 22% on average and clicked on by 3.7% of your list. And that's just the industry average figures. You can do way better than that. Number seven, email marketing is so much less work than social media. It takes me about five minutes to write a quick email and about maybe 30 minutes to write a longer one. It takes way much more effort to achieve the same effect through social media. Social media is more time consuming and you a lot of the effort that you put into social media is wasted on the wrong people. Whereas with email marketing, you know that every single email that you write is going to exactly the right people. And number eight is the clincher for me. You can make way more money with email marketing. In fact, it's reckoned that for every person on your list, you should be earning about $1 per month. Think about that for a minute. That means if you have 500 people on your list, you could be earning $500 a month. And if you have 5,000 people on your list, you could be earning $5,000 a month. Of course, this doesn't happen by magic, but it's totally possible. Email marketing is way easier, less time consuming and less stressful than social media and pays way better. If you want to know more about how to get started with email marketing or more about how to do email marketing way better and take your email marketing to the next level, then I really recommend you check out my course, Email Marketing Jumpstart. Head over to productiveblogging.com forward slash EMJ uh, to find out more details. And I'll also put that link in the description below. I hope you found this video helpful. If you like this video, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up and for you to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you in the next video.